Hello guys, hope you are good. Today I want us to learn how to install Wireshark on our Kali Linux. Okay, my our first step is to open the terminal window on our Kali Linux 16. Just click here, terminal, double click. This is our terminal window. But for my case here, I have already installed Wireshark. I can just run Wireshark. You can just type Wireshark and enter. This is Wireshark. But if you don't have Wireshark on your Kali Linux, let's go through together on how to install the Wireshark. So our first step is to update, to run this update command, sudo apt, sorry, update, enter, and the password is Kali, let's wait for, let's wait for the update, it's because Updating the package list is an essential step before installing or upgrading software on your Kali Linux system as it is ensures that you have access to the latest version and patches provided by the distribution maintainers. That's why first before installing any package we should run the update command. That's why now we update any new version of our, of our Wireshark package. Let's wait for it to finish. Now update is done. Since I've already installed Wireshark, I can run apt list to check the list of all uh, installed packages. I can just run this. apt list for the new installation after sudo update now let's install the wireshark now this is the command sudo apt install wireshark Enter and the password is Kali. So installation is done. You can just run Wireshark now. Wireshark. Enter. This is the Wireshark. So for the new installation, we have only two commands. We have sudo update, sudo apt update. And we have sudo apt install Wireshark. Then you are good to go. Then run Wireshark. Just type Wireshark. Now we are, and this is our connections. We have Bluetooth. We we have Ethernet zero Ethernet zero. No traffic. Now let's run the ping so that we can get traffic from my computer. Command prompt. From here, let me ping, like, uh, let me ping Google, ping www.google.com. Now, this is the IP address of the Google. Okay, I can do the continuous pinging by last T. This is the IP of the Google. IP address. Let's go to our Wireshark to see to check the traffic. Now this is the traffic. Before we didn't have any traffic, but now after pinging, this is Ethernet zero. My cable. I've connected to my cable. Now we have the traffic. Let's click the traffic. This is how Wireshark uh, runs. We have time, source, destination, protocol, length. We can do a filter like here, 
you can just filter up now you get the app and you can come here and see the details of the filters the source the destination but so there's a wider topic or concept on how to use Wireshark please stay tuned for more videos welcome